Good evening for the last today's session of Republika in Thessaloniki. Um, I um, would thank you. And um, it is not really the last last um, because tomorrow there's a, there are plenty of uh, program parts. Uh, we um, have again uh, the boat from. Uh, um, our dear friends from Meazin, uh, thanks uh, to Steffen and uh, his crew that we could make this boat trip real. I um, also can tell you that we have a shared breakfast tomorrow at uh, Y. It's quite easy to reach because tonight uh, you, will be more, uh, you will be already there because our uh, closing party is happening there. So if you want to stay overnight, it's maybe also possible. But when you come to the party, you already know where you have to go tomorrow morning again for our um, speaker and team. And um, you're all invited to, to come um, also there. And we and I'm very proud and happy to, that we will do that together with the uh, um, Reworks Agora uh, conference tomorrow. We will have a, a shared session um, about uh, new connected worlds the rise of networks. We will talk uh, in the uh, concert hall and my dear colleague Norm is also on stage talking a little bit about his experiences of um, uh, festival organization. And so it is in the concert hall. You can check it um, online on our webpage also. It is a, a shared session together with Reworks. So we, um, we want to directly handle over uh, to these guys who are doing this amazing music festival um, from, from um, Thursday on uh, here in the city. And, but now before I get to the final closing words, I would like to, um, and now I have the, part, the side of the business card, which is in Greek. Uh, uh, I want to uh, uh, ask Elise Jaladou of the, uh, on stage. Um, on stage, she's the general director of the International Thessaloniki uh, Film Festival and our dear host. Thank you that we've been here in this amazing um, uh, buildings. And um, I think um, everybody uh, who watched the live stream and uh, uh, watched the, uh, the photos is very jealous not uh, to come here this year. But um, there's, I think, a good reason to come here next year. So thank you that we could be in here. And you want to introduce the fest festival that's happening in November this year. Yeah, actually, I'm very happy that you enjoyed the, the place, the venues. And uh, thanks to the team also who have been supporting technically this event. Uh, so um, actually, I wanted to thank you first for coming to Thessaloniki and to coming also f to the festival because, you know, the festival is a um, cultural organization. And for us also, it's all about connecting people and uh, connecting the audience with the directors, the producers between them. We are a hub for the industry. And um, it's true that since a few years, we don't produce the festival the same way. Everything is changing all the time. It's about changing in dissemination, in film education, uh, changing the way that we are projecting the films also, uh, changing the way we are reaching the audience. Um, so it was very enlightening for us also to uh, attend all these uh, sessions and to listen to the topics that you are explaining. And uh, so the festival is a cultural organization uh, based in Thessaloniki. We have the film museum, which is next door. So you have all visited the film museum. We have also a film museum and the library also, uh, film education programs with thousands of, ten of thousands of uh, children coming every year. Uh, we have collections, we have theaters, and uh, we have also uh, two big festivals. We, all year long we show films, we are normal cinemas, uh, but the two big events are the Festival of November, which is the uh, uh, Thessaloniki International Film Festivals, which is one of the oldest of the region. Uh, this year will be the 58th uh, edition. Um, the festival is an international film festival. It is addressed to the audience. We have uh, 80,000 um, um, spectators during the festival and we are welcoming the whole world, um, industry world also. So we are a hub for the industry as well. And uh, the Documentary Film Festival, which is in March, 
and it's pretty much the same for documentary and where we are one of the biggest also uh, in Europe for documentary. So we are, you are all welcome for, uh, in, to the festival, whether during the year, in November, in March, you have the choice. So thank you. So thank you again. Um, it, was, it was very nice to work with you and we hopefully come back next year. So uh, next I would like to um, ask on stage Tenya, because Tenya, without you, uh, we, we, we couldn't have managed to, um, to organize all of that. Um, so maybe you have a, a few words on our uh, local partners and the partnerships we had. Maybe um, we want to say thank you too. Okay, thank you very much for thanking me. <laughs> Uh, well, it was like a very nice experience um, uh, having uh, the Republica team uh, here and working together. And uh, we worked um, also with uh, very interesting uh, partners like uh, uh, people from uh, Reworks uh, Festival. And uh, this you will see like tomorrow, the Reworks uh, Agora. We worked uh, with uh, people from uh, Soul Food uh, uh, Thessaloniki, so they were responsible for our very nice uh, music, and we are really planning to uh, to uh, have more partnerships and more. Uh... Why are you laughing? <laughs> okay. Yes, um, in other projects that already restart. I have to restart <laughs> now. <laughs> reboot. Yes, uh, we thank you for reboot. So we worked with Phil. <laughs> Yes, uh, so we worked also with uh, uh, the, our boat with uh, Mercy for these uh, really great uh, sessions that a uh, lot of people they came and uh, experienced. Um, I'm coming from uh, Apodec, which is like a, a local business creative platform here in Thessaloniki. We own this uh, place with uh, Mariana Coti and we are running it like for five years now, hosting many like workshops, speeches and talks and uh, co-workings and performances, exhibitions. Mm, I don't know, like, I don't want to forget partners, but uh, we also have to, like, except from the people that we worked together, we really had some supporting partners that they were really into the uh, venue all time and they were really reacting with the audience which was OK Thess, which is like one of the biggest hubs in Thessaloniki like uh, with so nice innovative projects that a lot of people uh, experienced like uh, applications like uh, moving which is transport uh, application like uh, electronic bikes like um, uh, also, I don't know if they were working also with uh, startups who are now starting to develop and getting funded and w moving forward. We had uh, open knowledge. We were having like a really, really nice uh, talk with um, also Resilient City about smart cities. And uh, their talk was also hosted uh, today on stage two. And uh, we had like, um, I can't remember the other, other partners. Okay, this so was in, in, so in, in, in this situation, I would say to uh, all of you, we forgot. Thanks to the tech team, anyhow, because without you, yeah. uh, we couldn't have the live stream, we couldn't have all the, the, um, uh, the slides, etc. So uh, please give a warm applause to the team around here. Thank you very much. Um, it's always. A first time is a first time. I think it worked very well uh, in this combination. So, very uh, thank you again. Um, I also want to say uh, thank you uh, to the Federal Foreign Office of Germany, which made it possible that we could do it here. Um, they were very supportive, and um, if you meet some of these guys um, somewhere, uh, 
uh, tell them how uh, nicely the experience of Republika uh, in Saloniki was, because maybe they will support us to come back next year. So please, an applause to this uh, for ministry. And now we, um, now the hugging is starting. Tinia, no, not go, go away. No, um, because now I would like to have um, all the um, Republika team on stage. Um, because without you, it wouldn't be hap uh, happening here. So the whole crew from the Republika Thessaloniki, please join the stage. So uh, Simon and uh, Phil and um, where are you all? Mark and Norman and Christina and Anna and Vale and Max. And uh, yeah, hugging. Okay. So thank you very much for this great support, Markus. Um, uh, I can't believe that it is um, already over because um, uh, it was only um, uh, a week ago that we uh, even started. And so there's Sandra and Vicky, of course, and um, Caro. So on Florentine, of, of course, the, uh, uh, the first, no, the second. Republica for him. Um, so uh, what I wanted to do now is um, two things. Um, thank you very much for the support. Um, it was a really crazy journey with, uh, with all the equipment from uh, Berlin to Dublin to, uh, to Saloniki and uh, to listen to all this interesting um, presentations we heard all the days. Uh, from Saloniki I take away that we have been very international, very focused on the region but also widely beyond and I think this is an interesting um, approach we should follow in the next years. What I want to do now is, um, I want to tell you what the motto for the next uh, Republica is in 2018. Uh, it's uh, uh, very simple um, and uh, we have a beautiful slide for that, you've already seen it. Maybe I press here. No. Wrong. So, <laughs> it is pop. So, we, 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 Republica goes pop. We will, um, we will discuss a lot of things about um, the um, digital society, how it um, changed into mainstream. When we started back in 2007, it was um, um, that we addressed a community, so a simple um, community of uh, people who are writing into the internet. Um, but today all our topics are went much more mainstream, uh, so we, if you get um, into this um, Andy Warhol quote of the famous 15 minutes, this is Today, possible that uh, by a coincidence, somebody can uh, can be a, a real star globally. Um, but we also want to focus on um, populism and all these topics. Um, so it is, a, um, as always, a motto is just a, a frame for uh, what we uh, what we want to do that next year. And. Um, I was really um, excited when we talked first about it, and uh, the designers too, I think. So this is not the final design, of course, it's just a starting point. And so the call for participation um, for the conference in Berlin is starting in November. So this is the next uh, big date for us. Um, so think about what uh, the pop culture, the pop art, or all the uh, pop uh, music maybe uh, could be uh, in, uh, together with the digital society. So. Um, now uh, I have a small present for you, um, and, and then we go for a drink, I think, huh? So the, the best idea had Norman, so maybe you want to? Um, so who wants first? Tenya. So, so we have this special hat for all of you, please. Because if we go to, to the next journey, it, it would be very, very good to, uh, to have a Republica hat with you. It, and it's not a must to wear it. You can maybe give it as a present. Um, uh, because it's a very limited edition of only 40. And, and I hope, uh, manage that. I hope for you. I hope to see you all in uh, 2018 in Berlin and at the next edition of Reconnecting Europe. And I think that was Republika Thessaloniki. Thanks for coming and have a nice evening.
Fotos. Nee, wird nicht passen. Das sieht dann sehr... Das sieht noch ein bisschen anders aus. Deswegen.